My name is Joe and I'm an Applications Engineer here at Hawk Ridge Systems. Today we're going to go over a new tool for 2014, the Angular Running Dimension tool, which you can find on the drawing side of SolidWorks by uh, going to the Smart Dimension drop-down and uh, choosing your Angular Running Dimension. Uh, you may have come across some of these complicated cylindrical parts uh, in your engineering travels. Some of them are pretty uh, difficult to draw or portray in a drawing, uh, like this part here has multiple cuts. Uh, holes and even this little wedge cut here that runs all the way through the part. So let's take a look and see what this looks like using the standard Smart Dimension tool. Yeah, that's pretty ugly. There's a lot, a lot of things going on here. It's pretty cluttered, and uh, your machinist might not be particularly happy with you if you handed him this drawing and asked him to make this part. So let's take a look at what happens when we use the running, uh, the Angular Running Dimension tool instead. We'll select it and we can choose a starting point to reference all of our dimensions from. And how this works is you just uh, pick any vertices or whole centers that you'd like to dimension and just work your way around your part, just like so. And we'll finish that up there and call it good. And now you can see how we have the same amount of information as before but without all the clutter. So we can clean this up even further by dragging these out a little bit and choosing to rejog our uh, dimensions here and that will clean up the text a little bit. But there's more that you can do with this. If you come here to the leaders tab we can actually choose to run this bi-directionally so that uh, your uh, angles start from the same starting point both clockwise and counterclockwise. We can uh, choose to extend the leader lines all the way to the center and we also have the ability to change the text position. So we can put them in line and we can clean this up again by rejogging. And you can see how those all nicely aligned to the edges of their leaders. We can also choose to display them horizontally like so. And uh, you can combine those with any of these other options here in the leaders tab like running it bidirectionally just to get the, the right look or to adhere to the standard that your company has, uh, has provided for you. So today we covered the Angular Running Dimension tool. Thanks for watching, and if you want more helpful videos like this, uh, subscribe to our Hawkridge Systems YouTube channel. Thanks for watching.